What's good everybody? Welcome back to the channel and welcome to the channel to everybody that's not been here before. Hope you guys are all having a great time. Today we're gonna be learning how I grew my beard in like eight months and I know you're probably here because you got a baby face or you might have patches and no one's beard is perfect. I have some stuff, boom. It's not completely filled in. This side's actually better. This side was my weak side before and this is my strong side but I started focusing on this side a little too much and now this is, you know what I'm saying? Anyway, let's go ahead and jump into the video. I'm gonna show y'all how to get into it. Anyone can grow a beard. Let me start off by saying that anyone can grow a beard. Now, the consistency of the beard and where it grows is completely different. So, my beard right now, I have terminal hairs right here. The terminal hairs are the thick hairs that you see. Vellus hairs, or V-less, however you say it, are the little light ones that you'll see. So, pretty much these guys right here on the top. These here are transitional hairs, I believe, and they'll turn into a terminal. They're a step above vellus, right? It can take up until like your mid thirties to grow like thick hair. Like these could take up until like I'm 30. Like they're really soft. You guys probably can't tell. And then right here is, is pretty, it's pretty coarse. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm gonna have something spicy for the end of the video where we can get a more direct comparison of where I am now versus where I was. So I first started off with just a derma roller. I got this derma roller right here off of Amazon. It's like 0.5. This is for those that usually don't have a whole lot of facial hair. You want to start off with a 0.5 and kind of just, you know what I'm saying? Kind of get it until your face starts turning pink or red and then pretty much back off from there. You only want to do it like with the 0.5 at least two days maybe, maybe three days. You don't want to do too much because you can scar your tissues and everything and make it to where you don't grow anything at all. I mean, you don't want that. You're not here because you don't want to grow anything at all. Another thing that I've been using since the beginning will be not specifically this oil, the Camille Rose. Um, really any oil I feel like is usable. Like Jamaican castor oil, this is black castor oil. So this stuff is solid, it smells good. I've been using tea tree as well. <laughs> I actually bought one and I pulled it out of my mirror and it hit the ground. So $10 is gone, bro. Just gone. And I'm showing you guys all this in order as well. So I started with a derma roller and was using nothing else but a derma roller and oil. You're gonna need an oil after you derma roll. Like there's no if, ands, or buts. And for a while, I was looking like this here. This is about a month three where I was just using a derma roller and oil. And of course, I mean, another weird odd end is brushing your face. Even though you're not gonna have any hair on your face, you're gonna wanna still brush it uh, with a soft brush, not a hard one. It's gonna feel weird, but you're gonna still wanna do it just to kinda, you know, I guess get the pattern, get your hair, and once it does start coming in, you know, I guess you'll have it tamed in which way you want to go train and everything in which way you want it to grow and like i said all this stuff is going to depend on genetics as well like a lot of it but anyone can grow hair on their face anyone i promise you even females like if they use what i'm about to tell you next they'll be able to grow it as well trust me this is from target it's called hems and it wasn't this style either it wasn't this style this is my favorite style where it has the beaker and everything and you can drip it this one's really good um can you guys see that my bad Oh, hem's gone. Anyway, <laughs> hem's. <laughs> this is not sponsored. It should though, because it just down the drain, literally. But no, I started with the foam. And the reason I say you want to start with the beaker is because it gets to your skin. It's liquid form. The foam is liquid too, but it's like a foam. So it's going to really sit on top of your hairs, unless you're bald face. Now, this beard right here, I couldn't use foam. I mean, I could if I did all this and stuff, but with the beaker, you can just drip it into your beard and then kind of just rub it in. The foam kind of just sits on top. And I will tell you what, the foam got me here. And then as soon as I switched to this, bro, it was a whole game changer, I promise you, bro. And I'm not gonna lie to you, it was literally like a month apart. Like I went from the foam to the beaker or the, the liquid, I guess you wanna call it liquid. But I went from like, sh like barely any hairs to like shrub all the way through. So you'll see a lot of people like getting on here saying, oh, you need this product, you need this product, you need that product. Literally, I'm gonna show you, bro. Look, boom, boom, boom. And all these are gonna be in the description down below. This is most of the stuff is on Amazon. Derma roll, this is where you start off. And then once you get somewhere about here, I'm actually about to move up to a 0.75. But right now I'm just using a 0.5. And then you wanna use metadoxidal. You should start with this. Cause as soon as I started using this, 
boom, hair grows crazy. It's usually actually used for um, your scalp, <laughs> your head, but you, people use it on their face. There are side effects too. So when I first started using it, I actually had heart pop, pop, palpitations, heart fluttering or whatever for the first month. And after that, completely, I've been using it since for almost a year now, actually over a year now, haven't had any issues, knock on wood, because yeah, I haven't had any issues. And then oil, start to finish. You don't ever need to skip out on that, right? And I also have this, which I just picked up. This is a balm. This is called Honest Honest Amish. This stuff is solid from what I can tell so far. I've only been using it a couple days, maybe like a week or so, um, like 10 bucks. And you know, I'll show you what it looks like on the inside. That's what it looks like right there, boom. You see that? This stuff right here, you need this too. So start off with this as well. With your face, boom, get it in there, bro. I'm trying to tell you. All this stuff will help you shortcut the the long phase I had to go through. I think you can even cut. If I knew all this stuff from the jump, I think I could go from eight months to like a good four to five. And then of course you got your combs and everything. These, I don't even know where these even came from. They just appeared. I, I literally, I don't know where these came from. They're combs, you know what I'm saying? And then always a brush. I got this brush. This is a wave curve brush or something like that. This will be in the description as well. I'm gonna find it for you guys. Put it in the description so you're not sitting here hunting or anything like that. So. Moving on, I wanted to do a comparison, right? This is off of Amazon too, if you guys wanna get this. This is cheap though, like it doesn't give you a sharp line unless you really know what you're doing. Anyway, I'm about to get into it. I'm about to do a comparison of how my beard will look all the same length that I'm gonna restart. Cause a lot of hair right now is, I mean, I'm, I'm sure there's a couple of patches in here and there's a lot of longer hairs that are kind of covering up those patches. So I wanna really see exactly where I'm at. See how thin it is on the sides? I'm gonna grow it thicker this time, watch. It's gonna grow thicker, and hopefully I can get these hairs to go terminal so it looks thicker. I mean, once you do this, I mean, I'm grateful. I'm really grateful, because I went from this to, well, not this, not because it's all crazy, but you know what I'm saying, so I'm grateful. I'm not gonna go too, too short. Am I tripping? Yeah, I think I should go a little bit shorter. I think I should step one down. <laughs> this is where it gets kind of like, okay, are you sure you want to do this? But yeah, fuck it, right? Well, you always, I'll start down here. Oh! <laughs> Let's see what it looks like brush down. Cause I did definitely give myself a little baldy ball. But why would I do that? Y'all ever do something like, man, I knew I should have did that. Y'all probably gonna be on your like, don't follow his advice, you don't know what the hell he's doing. A few moments later. I mean, that's solid, bro. <laughs> I think it's solid, you know what I'm saying? Like, hold on. It's a, it's a, it's a different, it's a different look. This video took a twist, man. Look, y'all are getting some, y'all are getting some, like, some for real entertainment right now, bro. Y'all go ahead and leave a like if you haven't already, because this is real life entertainment. Damn, I got a peanut head, bro. Look, dude, I just took off like a good, how many years did I just take off? I took off like a good four years. I'm 21 again. Yeah, I'm 25 right now. I can get a rental car. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you haven't subscribed already, you definitely should, because a lot of this kind of stuff tends to happen. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'm gonna mess with y'all next time. I'm also gonna give an update. So follow me on Instagram and uh, TikTok and everything. You'll be able to see how it starts coming back in. Of course, this right here, we're not gonna talk about this. This down here grows pretty fast, so I'm not really worried about it. But y'all see the updates on my TikToks and Instagrams, which is gonna be right here. Boom. Y'all take care.